Welcome to Huddersfield. Home to the Lund family. Mum Mandy, stepdad Dave, 14-year-old Daniel and 11-year-old Shannon. The kids eat what they want, watch what they want and go to bed whenever they want. But now it's time for Mandy and Dave to face the shocking truth. You're killing your kids. <laughs> Expert Chris Morin has used state-of-the-art technology to produce startling images of how the kids will look at 40. The parents' verdict? Unbelievable. Now with Chris's help, the Lunds have just three weeks to radically overhaul their lifestyle. God, that's healthy. <laughs> They've all got to adjust to living by Chris's tough new rules. Daniel, I don't care whether he's boring or not. But can Mandy and Dave succeed in changing the face of their kids' future? Oh, oh, oh. Meet Chris Murray, child psychology expert, advisor to government and industry, and mother of three. Chris has serious concerns about the Lund's lifestyle. Dave and Mandy say that they love their children, but the way things are going, they're putting Daniel and Shannon on a fast track to an early grave. The kids' eating habits couldn't be more different. They take forever, they use micro meals. Shannon eats enough junk food for two. My favourite food is crisps, chocolate, crisps, chocolate, that's it. <laughs> and she goes to great lengths to sneak it up to her bedroom. Oh, yeah. But Daniel will do anything to avoid eating regularly. Daniel, I would say, is on the verge of having an eating disorder, basically. I have to force him, a lot of the times, to eat food. If I do not want to eat, I will not eat. Bus driver Mandy keeps the house spotless, but when it comes to cooking healthy meals, she's not so keen. We're not healthy at all, because I've always been a working mum. It's always been a case of what's quick. And that means takeaways up to four times a week. No, that's diet. Food's not the only issue. The kids are glued to the TV and the computer for a massive 50 hours a week. While Mandy and Dave hide away in their bedroom. Sometimes we'll go to bed half past eight, something like that, just so we can get away. Leaving the kids downstairs to feed themselves choose their own bedtimes and come back down for snacks whenever they please. Breaking the Lund's bad habits won't be easy, but Chris Morin has the power to see into the future. By combining cutting-edge computer technology with scientific data,